It's me, Bree Reads! Hi friends! It's me, Bree! Today, let's read a story together! No one owns the colors. No one owns the colors by Deanna Davy. Illustrations by Brenda Rodriguez. If pink is for girls, then it's also for squirrels because no one owns the colors. They say blue is for boys? Well, that just annoys because no one owns the colors. If trees can be seen dressed in red, gold, and green, then I'll wear chartreuse. And please don't be mean, because all nature's hues are on the same team, and no one owns the colors. If sunsets go changing their outfits each night, from violet, peach, turquoise, all glowing with light, then I can wear butterscotch or scarlet even. I'll copy the trees and I'll change with the seasons. For colors exist everywhere, every day. No one can say, just for us, while they play, or assign them to right or wrong tones, good or bad. If anyone tells you other than that, ask them. Do ocean waves argue with sky over blue? Do chameleons have only one color to use? Does red avoid yellow and try not to touch? Or do they unite to make Neon Orange Crush? All creatures on Earth are their own special shade. Each fur tone and skin tone is uniquely made.
from ginger to tawny to apricot pie, the shades of our clothes, of our skin, of our eyes. From redwood to emerald to mocha to blue. There are colors we're made of and colors we choose. So what is the name of the color of you? And what does it feel like? Bold? Shy? Brand new? Now, if somebody tells you your color is wrong, be it skin, favorite crayon, or your fuchsia sarong, smile back at that person politely and say, the trees and the frogs and the cool ocean spray, they all share their colors, the dark ones and light, and so do the rainbows that dress the sky bright. So all of those colors I also can wear. I'm naturally perfect in all of my flair. For all of those colors, I also can be. If you look with your heart, then I think you will see that the colors of me and the colors of you all come from the same glowing planet. It's true. And whether the color is olive or jet, cobalt or licorice, mauve or violet, indigo, marigold, teal or bright white, when they fill you with joy, then they'll always be right. Silver and charcoal, magenta or bronze. When colors are part of us, they're never wrong. We're all part of nature. It's how we unite. 
and nature is dressed in the best colored light. The colors of sunsets and squirrels and trees. The colors of seasons and shimmering seas. The colors of you and the colors of me. Just like rainbows are truly and naturally free. Because no one owns the colors. Thank you for reading with me today, friends. Ooh, what color are you? Well, whatever color you are, whatever color you like, that's okay. The ocean doesn't argue with the sky over blue, no. The colors are for all of us. No one owns the colors. Now, I'd like to say thank you to the author for sharing her book with us. Let's meet her now. Hi, Gianna. Thank you, Bree, for having me. I am so honored that I got to share my book with you all today. My name's Gianna Davy, and I am the author of No One Owns the Colors. <clears throat> I'm also a mother of two sons, and I'm a dancer of all kinds, and I'm an artist and a teacher, and I'm really happy to be here today. Thank you for having me. So I wrote um, this book because once I heard someone say that pink is for girls and blue is for boys. And to be honest, that just did not feel right to me because I looked out into our wonderful world and I saw the beautiful sunsets and I talked to my two sons and I said, wait a second, that beautiful pink sunset Sunsets are for everyone, even if they're pink. And so pink can't only be for girls. And then I looked out at the beautiful blue ocean and I was thinking about how much I love that beautiful blue ocean. And I'm a girl and just because it's blue doesn't mean that it's only for boys. So I wanted to write a book to make sure that everyone understood that colors are just part of our world and they can never be right or wrong and no one can ever own them. They are just part of our world. Thank you so much for having me today and I hope you have the most beautiful day being you and loving all of the colors that you love. Thank you so much for sharing your story. Friends, you can purchase your own copy of this book at the link in the description and you can find me on Instagram. Please subscribe to my channel for more books and more fun. See you next time. Bye-bye.